Question 13. The following circle has been divided into eight congruent sectors by radii, where theta is the central angle formed by two consecutive radii. So one, two. Find the measure of the degree of theta in degrees, and then find the measure in radians. So the degree part is simple, right? We go all the way around how many times? We're cutting it into eight. So 360 degrees is all the way around the circle, and we're going to divide that by eight to get the degree of theta. So this is 45 degrees. And from here, you can look at your unit circle. Maybe you know it. If not, you can convert to radians using your conversions. I'm going to use the unit circle. 45 degrees is equal to pi force. So I didn't pull out the unit circle, but if you look at it, that's what it is. So 45 degrees and then pi force is that radian measure.